Canadian companies are pushing the digital entertainment envelope. In this panel, we've got companies on the cutting edge. Welcome to the front runners. And in this afternoon's performance, the role of Scott Simpson, CEO of Bitheads, as in your program, will be played by Trevor Fencott, president of Bitheads. <laughs> Make that little change. Uh, but we are pleased to have Ali Ranama, Vice President of Digital Media for the Star Media Group, moderating the panel. He's going to do a much better job than that at introducing the, uh, the rest of the panel in a moment. But a bit about Ali. He is leading the development and growth of the Star Media Group's digital strategies, assets on the web, mobile, and social platforms. He has nearly two decades of experience in print and digital media in Canada and Europe, working in strategy, corporate development and operations leadership positions for Torstar Corporation, the Globe and Mail, Bell Canada, the Irish Times, and the World Association of Newspapers. And he co-founded themarknews.com. I'll let Ali take it from here. Over to you. Thank you, sir. Um, so we have four firms here that, uh, that really are, at the, uh, uh, in many respects, are at the, at the cutting edge of, of the sort of continued and very rapid evolution of, uh, of you know, what we'll call screen-based entertainment for, as a shortcut. Um, you know, obviously, we've, for years now, sort of heard about a lot about that, that sort of uh, continuing uh, um, or that continuum of, of, of consumption to true interaction, and, and that's meant very different things as technologies evolved, right? So it was, the mouse was the great interactive tool, and, and obviously we've come a long way from that point. Um, we've also heard a lot over the years, and especially in the last couple of years, it was the, the you know, at, at certainly any, uh, any industry conferences I was at, um, you know, this whole thing about the second screen and the TV companies were really excited about the second screen but also really scared of it because obviously eating into, well, you guys know all that better than I do. Um, but, but really, it's a multi-screen world. And I think, um, uh, you know, one of the things, and we were talking about this uh, last night, is, is if you haven't seen it, there's a really interesting um, video that Corning put out um, called A Day Made of Glass. And it's, it's a little bit of the glass industry um, kind of throwing down to the rest of the uh, technology world, saying, okay, the glass part, we've covered off. Um, you guys just need to figure out power, OS, the media habits. But this is a video, it's about three, four minutes. If you haven't seen it, it's well worth uh, checking out because it's really just this notion of screens everywhere that do a lot of different things and a lot more than they are doing, doing today. And that's, that's worth a quick glance. Um, I'll do the, just sort of a quick lineup of, of who's on the panel um, and then let them talk to uh, their businesses and why they're, uh, they're, uh, they're so awesome. Um, <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, Jay Bennett is the creative director of uh, Smoke Bomb Entertainment. Um, Ken Sato is co-founder and CEO of uh, Massive Damage. Uh, Trevor Fencott is, is the president of BitHeads. Um, and, uh, and my new best friend, Nick Solsky, <laughs> is co-founder of InGamer. Um, so, what, the way we'll, we'll run it is, is uh, each of the guys will, will sort of talk to their, uh, their, their business and their product, um, and, then, uh, and then we'll have a sort of conversation and open up to questions fairly quickly. So without further ado, Jay. Cool. Okay. Uh, hey, I'm, I'm Jay Bennett. I'm the creative director at Smoke Bomb. Uh, Smoke Bomb, we're the digital arm of Shaftesbury Films here in Toronto. And so our mandate is twofold. Uh, one, we extend uh, all of Shaftesbury's uh, television and film properties onto other screens. So for kids stuff, that's sort of more interactive gaming experiences, um, usually online. And then for the more adult programs, that's usually more video-based uh, experiences online and then onto tablets and phones. Uh, the second stream of the, what we're doing is uh, with our good friends uh, on this project and another project we're working on through the CMF experimental stream, um, we are creating uh, our own IP, our own app for iTouch, iPhone, uh, iPad, um, original content. And so that's what I wanted to demo for you guys today. Uh, it's a project called Totally Amped, and it launches January 26th in the Apple App Store. So I wanted to start by showing a trailer, about a minute 40, and we'll just watch that and, uh, yeah, actually we can just start with it. You're listening to Red and Rail Radio. It is the hit song, favorite song in my head. Are you ready to shoot for the stars? Get ready, because Charlie Fever's looking for the next big act to open his concerts at the end of the month. What am I doing with my life? You got a good voice. Oh, no, I don't. I'm just kidding. Tomorrow, 5 p.m. sharp. Can you make it? Hold on, what do you mean by sharp? 
they don't wow me. Since I mostly made of wow, I need my clothes to keep up. Cute is gonna be when I land a record deal and you don't. Girl, I know you like me, but who can blame them? I'm banging. Can't get enough of me, ladies? Bender, please. We have eyes. When you're the star of the show, you'll understand how much pressure is on a sleeping lady. It's like being an air traffic controller who's also really hot. There's only one girl in my mind. Arya, isn't it? I don't even know if she feels the same way. I'm gonna call you Pooh Bear. You know why? Because you must be rolling in honeys. <laughs> Meet the competition. That's our song. Did you just realize you're gonna lose? There's for people too stupid to cheat. Woot, woot. <laughs> Who wants a little inspiration? Me, me, my mama. I'm ready. You have a beautiful voice. Stop hiding it. We're gonna open for Charlie Fevers. You know it's a contest, right? Okay, totally amped. Let's do this. Dream punch. Dancing at the speed of love. Dancing at the speed of love. I hate your t-shirt. Uh, cool. So, for all intents and purposes, that looks like a, a trailer for a film or TV series. Uh, the difference being is uh, what you see on the screen right now is this is plugged into my iPad. So, this is uh, the world's first uh, series as an app. So, uh, you download the app, um, you get the first episode for free, and then you get... Uh, so, you can see here we have ten episodes in total. Uh, it'll be $4.99 to unlock everything as one purchase out of the gate uh, once you've uh, consumed your free content. But what starts to set this apart is it takes what Smoke Bomb used to do, which is a TV property exists, and then we go and create some type of experience around that on a secondary platform, and it packages it within that experience. So that's what we're doing now. We're putting a single wrapper around an entire project. So in this, after watching each episode, you unlock more content. So you can go in and you can karaoke. So you can actually record your own voice singing along with all this original music. Uh, which I will not demonstrate for you at this point. Um, you can then actually go and take, if you want, what you've recorded or without it, and then actually go and start to remix the song yourself. So we've gone and uh, put in all these tracks. So I can take out the voice. Da -da. So I can mute that. Da -da. Maybe I'm just going to do it with piano. Maybe some guitar. All that. Let's kick some drums. Um, and then, as as the user, this is targeted, I should say, at uh, at tween girls is is the main market we're going after for this. Um, you can then go and you can become the director. So you can actually go and recut the music videos within the project. So again, using the touch screen, I can go and select the camera angles I want to use. And I can. I like fast cutting because I'm a music director. And then you can actually go save, and it will play back what you've created. This is very quick, but you'll go and notice my awesome quick cutting has brought together this sweet music video. Seems like yesterday, not long ago. Uh, and then, of course, what would be complete, especially for our, uh, our tween female audience, uh, then you can go and design. So you can actually go and uh, create clothing um, that you can design yourself. You get all these features, materials. Let me throw something together here for you. What do you think? Like that. Boom. <laughs> we'll throw on a totally amped logo. Doom like that. Uh, you can design your clothes, you can dress all the characters, and then you can create uh, album covers, wallpaper, um, everything, which you then go and share with your friends through social media platforms. Uh, you want to put that on Twitter, you want to put it on your Facebook page, you want to email it. That's all possible. Uh, we've done this with a uh, great partnership, uh, XMG Studios here in Toronto, who are app developers. And uh, we then also think secondary to that. So you can then go to iTunes and you can actually buy the album. So you can buy all the songs uh, with lyrics, without. Um, and now we're even thinking to the next step ahead where we may even go and create the fictional music label, because this is all based around a, a music company, and start using that as a, a, a sort of third tier opportunity to start even releasing more music on top of that. So we might create additional songs. And now we're even getting interest from music publishers like RCA who want to come and say, look, we recognize you have a property. Can we go and start selling our music through uh, this brand that you're creating? So in a nutshell, that is 
totally amped. Very cool. And, oh, and, and I, I should close by, again, uh, this would not have been possible without the CMF experimental stream. Um, this is one of the first projects out of the gate for their, their first tier. I think now they're in their, their third round. But again, I, uh, a shout out to that because it was sort of their thinking in terms of how can we go beyond and start to look to the next step of, of they really push that in, in terms of companies here in Canada thinking beyond sort of what we understood to be screen entertainment, which is we all thought, oh, it's an online series or something. And, and I think this starts to represent that next evolution. So CMF. Checks in the mail. <laughs>